Well, seven women who uh, were attacked in North Park over the summer took the stand just minutes ago detailing some terrifying moments for Ten, them. Yeah, 10 News reporter Jared Ayers is live at the downtown courthouse with some of these details. Jared. Virginia Roberts, some of those victims say David Drake attacked them from behind, hit them in the back of the head and the face, and then tried to rape them. A few of the victims even broke down when they were asked to relive that horrifying moment. The judge asked us not to show David Drake in court today, so we've blurred his face, but he sat quietly in court as those women took the stand one after another. Drake faces 18 counts of assault, sexual assault, and battery for allegedly attacking those seven women. Prosecuting attorney Jennifer Tagg says he com he's admitted to the crimes and DNA evidence links him to the victims. One of those victims, identified only as Emma, says she's been suffering memory loss since that attack, and she talked about some of the injuries that Drake gave her that night. My face was horrible. It was gigantic, and I had um, bruising on each side. It was completely the same on both sides. And I had, yeah, symmetrical, yes. And then um, a lot of, I think the scraping was on my left side. I had a lot of scrapes on one side, and my lip was busted, and I had um, scrapes on my wrist, and my hands were, were hurt. They hurt. This map details the attacks. You see, they all happened over four months this past summer and all centered around North Park. You may remember those attacks led to lots of community rallies and an effort to fix streetlights, make North Park a safer place. I just spoke to one of the organizers of those rallies last week. He told me that effort continues even now, 10 months after the attacks. Live downtown, Jared Aarons, 10 News.